uh it, it has to be kind of a it's sort of a paradoxical thing to be sort of stuck behind eric shoji maybe probably the best libero of all time yep. in, in usa anyway yeah, yeah, yeah. where it's like it's kind of like being the back like micah christensen's backup setter it's like you could be one of the most talented setters in the world probably not going to take his spot but also who better to learn from one of the best of all time it's really cool and i i'd say like i'm appreciative of the age gap because it's not like that yeah too awkward or like, right, right, right. like, like i can i can learn from him yeah. i'm like okay always yes. always he loves he it so we we still like keep in touch and obviously like if i ever needed anything i could reach yeah. out um it's normal it's, it's natural it's really cool to learn from him and um just like be able to watch and learn from him but also be able to like ask, ask questions or, and stuff. yeah exactly yeah, super yeah. cool